Dear student, in this video we will learn chapter number 4 construction of triangles practice set 4.3 if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe it today itself let's start so today in the topic construction of triangles practice set 4.3 to construct a triangle if its perimeter and the angles which include the base are given let us see question 1 Construct triangle PQR, angle Q 70 degree, angle R is given 80 degree and PQ plus QR plus PR. Now PQ plus QR plus PR means perimeter of triangle PQR is given 9.5 cm. So this is the construction we have to do. Okay. First step, we will draw a rough figure for that. Okay. Let us see. Well, this is the triangle we have angle Q 70 degree and angle R 80 degree. So these two angles must be on the base. Okay. This we can make angle Q and this is angle R. And here we have this is point P. So triangle PQR angle Q 70 degree. This is 70 and this angle R is 80 degree. Okay. And already explained in the analysis part. See what we have to do. We have to extend this QR on either side. On left side you have to extend and on the right side you have to extend. Okay. Now here we mark one point as point T and this is point say point S. Now this we have extended this on the left and the right side such that TQ is congruent to QP and this RS is congruent to PR. Okay. And draw this segment. And join P to S also. So, we have now triangle PTS. We are going to construct triangle PTS. Okay. First, we will construct triangle PTS. Okay. Where, now as explained in the analysis part, this TS, this base will be 9.5 centimeter. Okay. This base will be 9.5 centimeter. Now, this angle T as explained in the analysis part angle T will be half of this this will be 35 degree and angle S will be half of this it will be 40 degree ok so construct triangle PTS where we have TS equal to 9.5 centimeter and we'll take angle T equal to half of angle Q and angle S equal to half of angle R. Therefore, angle T we get half into 70 degree and angle S equal to half into 80 degree. Okay. So, angle T equal to 35 degree and angle S equal to 40 degree. So, we will construct triangle P, T, S with this given information. And now to locate position of point Q and R, locate position of point Q and R, we will draw perpendicular bisector of P, T. We will draw perpendicular bisector of P, T. You can see, you have to draw perpendicular bisector of P, T and P, S. So this is the rough figure we have drawn. Let's start with the actual construction now. First we will draw the base TS 9.5 cm. 9.5 cm draw the base TS now. Well, this is TS which is 9.5 cm. Okay. Next step. Angle T 35 degree. This angle T 35 degree. Make angle of 35 degree here. Okay. Draw the ray. 
and at point S draw angle of 40 degree 40 degree at point S so this is point P ok children so see we got triangle PTS where the base is 9.5 cm angle T 35 degree and angle S is 40 degree ok triangle PTS now to locate position of you can see in the rough figure to locate position of point Q and R we have to draw perpendicular bisector of PT and PS ok let us do that first we will draw perpendicular bisector of PT keep the rounder on point P you can see take more than half distance you can see that take more than half distance ok now from this point P draw perpendicular bisector draw the arc on the either side from this side and this side and then from point T also cut the arc on the either side draw the line so this is the perpendicular bisector of PT we have drawn ok and now draw the perpendicular bisector of PS keep the rounder on point S take more than half distance you can see take more than half distance and then from point P also so we have drawn the perpendicular bisector of PT and PS now see the position of point Q this point name it as point Q and this is point P R ok this is point Q and this is point R and your triangle is PQR so draw P to Q draw P to Q and point P to R ok children so you can see that we have constructed triangle PQR now this point Q this angle Q is name it 70 degree and this angle is given as 80 degree so this is the required construction we triangle P Q R we have constructed so in the topic construction of triangles practice at 4.3 question 3 construct triangle LMN angle M 60 degree angle N given 80 degree LM plus MN plus NL 11 centimeter and LM plus MN plus NL means perimeter of triangle LMN is 11 centimeter given let us see how we go for this first we will construct a rough figure for this well this is triangle ok angle M angle N is given so name mark it on the base angle M and angle N angle M given 60 degree angle N is given 80 degree ok and then this point is L now in the rough figure we are going to extend this MN on the either side ok extend this MN on the either side as explained in the analysis part extend on the left side and on the right side you can see mark this point as S and this is point T so we have taken extended here such that SM equal to LM and NT equal to ln ok draw this segment sn and draw l to t so see children we are going to first construct triangle lst right constructing triangle lst and ex as explained in the analysis part we are going to have st this base st equal to 11 centimeter so first we will construct triangle LST okay where ST equal to 
11 centimeter this base is 11 centimeter okay and angle s this angle s will be half of angle m this angle s will be 30 degree and angle t will be half of angle n this will be 40 degree okay and now to get position of first we'll construct triangle l s t then how to get this point m and n we have to draw perpendicular bisector of l s and l t we'll show in the rough figure also and okay now let us start with the actual construction first we'll draw base st 11 centimeter okay 11 centimeter draw the base this is st 11 centimeter okay then angle s 30 degree you have to make angle s 30 degree and at point T make angle 40 degree okay and this is point L so we have constructed triangle L S T base is 11 centimeter angle S we got we have constructed 30 degree and this angle T is 40 degree now to get position of point M and N we have to draw perpendicular bisector of LS and LT so let us draw perpendicular bisector of LS you know how to draw perpendicular bisector rounder on point L take more than half distance see children more than half distance you have taken cut the arc on the either side okay, you can see that and on this side then from point S also draw the arc ok and draw the line draw the perpendicular bisector Now we will draw perpendicular bisector of LT okay, in the same way rounder on point T take more than half distance see children more than half distance you can take and cut the arc on the either side you can see and from point L also So we have drawn perpendicular bisector of LS and LT. Now see the position of point M. This is point M. Mark this as point M. And this is point N. And our triangle is LMN. So draw seg LM and LN. Okay. Triangle LMN where the perimeter of triangle is given. Angle M. 60 degree and angle L is given as 80 degree so we have constructed this triangle LMN okay with the given information